That's my boy. Well, I'm going to start at the beginning, and this video might be quite long, I'm not sure, but we started at about 7 a.m. at the Red Cliffs Lodge, about 17 miles outside of Moab. It was a beautiful drive all along the Colorado River. Well, here we are coming into town, and we're going to make a right-hand turn. Uh, if you go to the left, that's where downtown Moab is.
One really nice thing was that all the Broncos had a walkie-talkie uh, to be able to listen to and talk to the team leaders. And uh, that's what's coming up. So right here we're going across a rock slab. A lot of times out here on these trails you'll, you'll go across sections of rock slab. And? And uh, the BLM, as they're marking these trails in this kind of area, when you're when it's a rock slab, they'll often paint a little white mark on the rock surface. And that is an indication that that's supposed to be the center line of the traveled route. And so you want to stick to that as closely as you can. Huh. So be on the lookout for some of those white paint marks. That's good. So just pull up behind us in a single file line. Yeah. And then... Uh, Set your parking brake first, and then shift into park, and then uh, we'll walk up with the rest of the people here. And turn off your Bronco while we walk up there. I'm a glow trotter. You and I, pick your nah, hajima, huri no mudala, we just different, I don't bother. Georgia na, jibi na, sasha na, gashinda no bala on, I'm a glow trotter. You and I, pick your nah, hajima, huri no mudala, we just different, I don't bother. Georgia na, jibi na, sasha na, gashinda no bala on. This area was our first stop and our first instruction from the team leaders of the three different groups, which totaled about 15 Broncos. And from here on out, the obstacles uh, or the trail got progressively harder and harder and more fun at the same time. Okay. Do you want to take her up? Want me to take her up? Uh, going sure. this yeah, we can, uh, hellacious her looking. So right now she's got no lockers on. We're just going to bring her up. And Good she's yeah, I got it. totally yep. a newbie. Come forward. Forward. Ask for one turn. Stop right there. All right, so now, you know, Jason had said, like, coming forward, passenger. Think quarter turns. When we say passenger, it's not, you know, we're not trying to, 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 to turn the Titanic here. Okay, I had to go get another battery. I brought plenty of them and a power pack, a couple power packs, banks, whatever. And what you probably already watched was what I consider a pretty nasty stair step like rock formation, but those Broncos are making easy money out of it. Okay. All right, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, you broke it. <laughs> All right. So, come on forward nice and smooth. There you go. Passenger, slow, because now that back needs to touch. There you go. Keep going, keep going, passenger, passenger, beautiful, there it is, right, nice, nice. Right, man, Watch the differentials, let's leave them open for just a second, alright, it's our turn,
RPM steady. A little bit of driver. There you go. So that left foot on the brake lets you approach that really, really slowly, like he's doing now. Back passenger now. More passenger. More passenger. A little bit slower. So a little bit more brake. More passenger. So we got in the situation where both of the rear tires are spinning now because they're one's hung up on a ledge and the other one's not got a lot of traction because of the way the rock is sloping there. So now we're going to go ahead and lock the front as well and then just ease back onto the throttle and ease back off the brake just a little bit. There we go. Nice and slow. See how slowly he's doing that? Should have been on my side, the low side. It's a little weird trying to do that with my braking foot. Yeah. Because it makes me feel like.